Hello everybody, it's Imuna. I'm coming back with my third video and this time I'm doing it out of the virtual world Second Life. Um, the two videos that I did before and first of all thank you to everyone that um, decided to subscribe to my channel and viewed the video and thought it was worth their time. I didn't intend on doing gameplay but I'm glad that I did because it gave me the courage to finally start uh, my YouTube channel which has been on my heart for about two years. Um, this year made 10 years that I have been a resident of Second Life. Second Life is a online virtual community and this is what I look like in Second Life. I um, work in corporate America in my real life and for anyone that's worked in corporate America or is working in corporate America you know that we don't have the luxury of using social media the way that some others can, um, especially those that have signed, you know, contracts that, you know, specifically say you will not, you know, embarrass or tar tarnish the name of the company that you work for. So we have to be very careful. As you see um, in the news, certain people that have expressed certain things are losing their jobs. So. Um, I have a family, I have things that I want to do, so this is the way that I safely um, express myself through Imuna, and um, I'm hoping to retire early so that I can do this as the person behind Imuna because that's my ultimate goal. Um, the reason why I wanted to start a YouTube channel is because uh, in December, it will make 10 years that I have been a YouTube uh, user. I found out about YouTube through Second Life, and I would go there and watch music videos. Then I learned about documentaries. Then I learned about other YouTubers that were creating content. So I started subscribing to those YouTubers, and I'm the kind of person like if I enjoy what you enjoy what you're doing and I appreciate it I'm going to tell you so I would leave comments for them and then I would get messages back from some of them they would look at my picture which is actually of Imuna as you see here and they would go wow how did you get your you know your little cartoon picture to look so real and this is like two years ago this really started uh, I started getting more questions and I was like I'm that's my avatar from Second Life and they would be like, what's Second Life? So Second Life, I believe, started in 2000, either between 2002 or 2004. And I'm surprised that, not more, that more people don't know about it. So what I want to do is I want to kind of bring YouTube and Second Life together. No, just, well, kind of together through me because I want people to know that Second Life is more than what they have heard in the news or read on an article. And usually it's been some bad things, you know, uh, parents neglecting their children to live these outstanding lives on Second Life, or people that have used Second Life to catfish and they've lured people in and, you know, taken advantage of them. Yes, those things do happen but they happen anywhere. So it's not like, you know, Second Life is the gateway to all of these things. With anything, you should practice safety and uh, being wise. But Second Life has more to offer than just those things that we read about, which aren't pleasant. Uh, take me for instance, I learned how to use um, Photoshop. I learned how to code a little bit better. Um, I even learned how to speak a little Italian because there are people from all over the world that are using Second Life and um, there are some of us that haven't traveled as much, you know, for whatever reason. So when you're speaking with people that live in other areas of the world, you really get a better idea of, you know, what their life is like and they get a better idea of what your life is like. So. Um, that's one of the most amazing things to me about Second Life. We also have people that are terminally ill or people that suffer from depression. And this is the way that they communicate with other people because we do need that, that 
connection with other human beings. I know um, I consider myself an introvert, but I still like to connect with people that, you know, I like in my space. And it does keep us emotionally and mentally healthier. So um, those are just a few of the good things about Second Life. Now, what I'm planning on doing, I'm going to do a series that I'm going to call uh, Being Black in Second Life because one of the negative things about being online is that people feel hidden and protected because they're behind a, a computer screen. They think they can say things um, that they wouldn't normally say in their real lives. And um, being a black woman in real life, as I, I, I mean, as black, I mean, we're probably the same shade, I think. Um, I've experienced things in these 10 years that have been really hurtful. It hasn't stopped me from doing anything, but I'm just amazed at what people think that they can do and say. And um, also, I, I hope that when I do this, some of it gets back to London Labs because I think that they can do better with how they handle people that, um, you know, attack, you know, through verbally or, you know, try to disturb the peace on, you know, where the person is, you know, doing their, their, their play in Second Life. Um, they need to take responsibility for how they deal with that because if you allow that element to continue, you know, the people that log on every day and, you know, use their, their time and talent and even their money to make Second Life what it is, you're allowing them to basically be bullied, which is not okay. So I'm going to do that series and we'll get to talk to some people. Um, the one thing that I'm really, really excited about is that I've met people that are not black in real life, but they live black in SL, if that makes sense. And some of them, the reasons why they're doing it, you know, when I've talked to them, they've come to see that, wow, what I'm doing is not right because of the way that I'm doing it and the reason why I'm doing it. And then there are people that just really appreciate, I've met one person that um, creates uh, content and the person just thinks that black women are just so beautiful and the way that this person puts together their avatar it is so clear that they appreciate the beauty they, they appreciate the beauty in women but particularly black women and as a dark-skinned black woman that just um, touched my heart so we're going to talk about those things too but what i wanted to do today was just to introduce my channel and um, I hope that you guys will subscribe if you're interested. I want you to leave me comments. If there's things that you want me to discuss, um, please send me a message. Um, I'm going to leave my social media sites. If you're NSL, you can send me an IM. I'm in uh, as Imuna Zamani. And um, hit the notification button, too, so that you'll know when I post. But um, I'm really, really excited about this. And I think it's going to not only um, put a better light on Second Life so people don't know that we're not these people that, you know, don't have jobs and sit in our parents' basements all day. I mean, I'm a single mama, mama of three kids. They're all grown now, but I'm, they're still in my wallet. Okay, well, h what is that? They get grown and they're still in our wallets, but that's another story. But I have a career, I have a side business, I'm an advocate, I volunteer, so I have a busy life. So I'm not just sitting here, you know, online being a, you know, a hermit with a blanket over my head. <laughs> so I just want to um, show people that there's more to an online community. It's not all what you think. So that's what my... Um, deal was for today. I just wanted to introduce my channel and offer any of you the chance to um, help me to grow it with your comments or your suggestions. And before I forget, because I know someone's going to ask me this, I am recording and editing with um, Wondershare Femora, Femora. I'll put the link in the description. Um, I did pay for it, but it was a minimal 
amount for the things that um, this um, application does. So I'm learning, like I still don't have an intro because I'm learning how to do that. I don't have an outro, but uh, through their channel, they have tutorials and things like that. And I know that I'm going to be able to do it and get better at it. So I'm excited about that too. Look at that. One more thing that I'm learning by being online. So it's wonderful. Um, I hope that everybody has a great weekend. Today is Saturday here where I am in Florida. And it's November the 18th. And I'm going to end the video now and enjoy a wonderful dinner with my kids. When I can get them all in one spot, it's a treat for me. So I'm going to take advantage of it. Okay, have a great evening. Goodbye.